Hello everyone, I am Jitendra Singh Bhaiya. I welcome you to read my story where I interview authors, speakers, coaches, celebrities, entrepreneurs and more. Today I have with me Ms. Monica Azad Sharma. She is the founder of Ariba Creation and an experienced freak who always uh, like to challenge herself and uh, like came out of status quo and make every event of life count. A fashion designer, diploma holder, and a natural bent towards French, she started herself as an entirely different scope of passenger service for 16 years in the aviation industry. As a woman, she has a firm belief in promoting and mentoring fellow women entrepreneurs. Her networking skill her, uh, help her in keeping her spirit high on diverse platforms, while she uh, present and represent her brand and the women's power. To circle back to her uh, work identity, she steered her career on the path of celebrating the beauty of intricate work of the artisans from different parts of India on fabrics through her brand. Experience with people all through her uh, professional career is also helping her drive her to work on different projects as part of uh, Lennis Club Delhi that involve helping the unprivileged and especially able children. Today she will be discussing with us about her life journey. So let us hear from her. Welcome Monica. The platform is open and now over to you. And uh, thankful to read my stories for uh, you know having me here and uh, considering me to be a part of this, which is like an honor, honestly. And we are uh, also privileged to have you on our platform. Thank you, thank you so much. So, uh, so first of all, I'd fun. like to know about you, uh, like uh, how your past life as a person affected you, uh, what you wanted to be in life, and what you are. Okay, so past life, I would say, uh, I think it's all linked, you know, the past, present, future, it is all connected. What you are, uh, you know, you, as a child only we think that we have to do this, we have to do this, and all, and then uh, as you grow, you try to accomplish that, and uh, right. then there are certain deviations which come in life, you choose a different path. But uh, then again, uh, so something like that has happened with me too. Uh, so when I was like clearing my uh, schooling, after that I did my fashion designing. So I am a diploma holder in fashion designing. Uh, and that time uh, it was, you know, for a, um, for a girl coming alone at uh, 10, 11, used to be a big thing. The community the right. was not too nice that time. It was not so easy. Yeah. So, uh, uh, yeah, so Uswaka, uh, this was the issue that came up that how would I continue and uh, with the field because it was more of uh, the export houses and buying houses job that were there for uh, women, for girls who were, did fashion designing. And on the other, there, is, uh, there was this thing that you know the time was a big time issue. Uh, like there was no restricted time limit that you, you had to work 9 to 5 or so. So it was right, not right. like a normal office job. So, yes. Then I started off with something thoda bahut ghar pe. I did, I started designing, I had my own embroider. So I did a bit of this for the new year. And then uh, finally uh, my mother discussed, told me that you have whole life to do something like this. So right. please explore the world. You should know what's happening around. This would restrict you to a particular place. Either you were working and gaining experience or uh, you know, uh, this is this has to be on a larger scale, but you have life to do that. Right. And then I did my French language. So okay. I did completed till the mid level French from uh, Orleans France uh, in South Extension. Uh, that was the unit there. And uh, then somehow, I don't know how it happened, but uh, somehow got through the aviation field. And uh, I think I had one of 
best time time of my life being there so challenging but still so nice meeting so many different people each day and uh, i think uh, it was brilliant right i got uh, so i had around 16 year plus experience with aviation mm-hmm. and uh, then uh, after the uh, birth of my second child so the mother of two boys okay so, uh, and uh, after the birth of my second child now uh, the family uh, picture came into being that yes now i'm a mom and i really need to think about them too right and, uh, right because with one child i think it's easy for any women so pura ka pura it it was not easy it was really not easy to give up uh my office people were like really really nice and uh, they helped me a lot uh, extensions of maternity and all but then you know i personally feel uh, we should not take advantage of somebody being too nice to us so finally <laughs> one day i decided <laughs> ki nahi ab nahi ho sakta and i really have to take a stand ki ab i have right. to wake up my mind and get that power in me to say no i cannot work further which was a big decision Correct. So finally, I took a break from their point, and uh, I was a mom, good wife, daughter-in-law, daughter, any relation you feel I could fulfill that uh, there because now I had the time to do it. All these Correct. years when you're working, you're on a you're on a rush, so you don't know what's happening. Right, right. And uh, so further on, uh, do I tell you each and everything? I think it's a big story. <laughs> No, uh, like we can, we can uh, uh, rush in. Uh, like uh, step by step would be a difficult thing to uh, yeah, discuss. Yeah, like very true, very true. Uh, you can this come into a conclusion while a part. This is the present where I am. <laughs> right. <laughs> Wonderful. So, uh, if I talk about your passion now, like what are the things you are passionate about in your life? Creativity. Creativity has always obsessed me. So I love to read about things. I love to be creative. I love, you know, that thinking has always been there because right. uh, that was the first thing which I did after my schooling, and that was the career I always wanted. Mm-hmm. And even in the aviation, it's your creativity. Right. How right. you get the positive feedbacks? Yes, customer service is also a kind of you. You have to be creative enough to have a good customer feedback. Correct. You know, uh, to be successful in a field. Yes, and every customer gave you a different kind of experience. Of course, each person that you meet, you learn something. There is not even a single person that you would meet and you wouldn't learn. You learn right. each day when you talk to somebody. And uh, my uh, professional life has, uh, you know, I've been very, very blessed to have that uh, career wherein I've learned so much from so many people. Correct, correct. So moving back to your work and experience, now you can share uh, like uh, what all you did in your career, uh, and uh, finally how and when you started your uh, like uh, entrepreneurial journey. Okay, so from where we left, uh, uh, you know, I had designed, and then I was having a good gala time with uh, my kids, a good, good family time. and uh, this is what happened was i started getting after 3 years i started getting a job offers from aviation okay. field as a travel trainer and uh, it's a very dramatic thing to happen but we were on a road trip with as a family and uh, to himachal and punjab that side and then i get a call from uh, aviation company so they wanted me they wanted to hire me as a travel trainer and okay. they said you know with so much of experience i think you would suit our uh, the position very much right and i i could not decide anything then mm-hmm. as well because again when you tra- when you working that there's a time fixation which is there and with kids uh, the you know with such younger kids the younger one was 3 the elder one was 8 year old right uh, i don't i was i really didn't feel like you know having them uh, going over to a day care center and the timing again was an issue mm. so again i could not accept that offer and where in you know as a mother i was uh, you know sure that i don't want it but as monica as one self as a woman i had that in my mind ki are mere ko itna acha mil raha hai logo ko second chance dena right. and i'm get i'm lucky enough to get that and i could accept it the so, woh cheez nahi 
सही इफेक्ट कर रही थी एंड दैट वाज इफेक्टिंग माय यू नो मूड स्विंग्स एंड द क्वालिटी ऑफ लाइफ आई वाज लीडिंग विद माय चिल्ड्रन वाज गेटिंग अ लिटिल डिस्टर्ब आई फील पर्सनली राइट राइट लिटिल सेल्फिश इन दिस बट यस ईच इंडिविजुअल इज आई बिलीव सम हाउ समवेयर करेक्ट सो टू माय I spoke to my hubby about this, and I said, "Listen, I'm getting so many offers. I can't do anything. I think, you know, I want to do. I want to get back, but at the same time, not disturbing my family routine. Too. Right. Because that is the that is of foremost importance to me, and uh, I don't see things beyond on that. But yes, uh, that me factor needs to be there with everybody. I think it's every individual needs that me factor." Correct, correct. Quality, so you wanted to also. balance it out between family and work. True, very true, very true. So uh, that is one. On the road trip, it was decided that uh, you know my, it was my hubby who dis, uh, you know suggested that why don't you go back to your roots? Correct. You have it in you. you can uh, actually uh, you know uh, go uh, you, you can actually do good in this field so why don't you start uh, reading again so what i did was i started reading again about things about fashion about fabrics about work right. about uh, what kind of work the, the artists and everything i started reading a lot because i firmly believe that uh, uh, khali ye nahi karna ki idhar se lena hai aur idhar sell off karna that is that is not what i wanted right so, that was not money was not the thing that came in to think it was the creativity that was that, that was my obsession and the, that me factor and that name that recognition i wanted which i could get only if i could uh, you know create something different from the normal so designing is the uh, thing you take care of yourself uh yes to a lot extent uh but uh, with ariha creation ariha creation was you know uh, came into being on a road trip okay and uh, the name was suggested by my hubby and uh, it is uh, we thought we mutually uh, you know agreed on it and it means winner ariha means winner okay so he said you are a winner and your brand name should be such which means you are a win- which means a winner so that is how the creation came to be so great uh, and then uh, i slowly started uh, studying about it reading about things gaining a lot of knowledge uh, contacting people con- connecting with different artisans all across so at at a river creations what we do is we pick up work of different artisans all across the country Okay. So and certain things we pick and choose, certain things we ask them to create for us. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, Great. Yeah. So I don't Wonderful. do that uh, paintings and all myself, uh, but I do have people who, who do that. I'm con- I'm connected with directly with the manufacturers of uh, a lot of stuff, which is a little different which you normally get from the market. So what all you do in this uh, like uh, garments, clothing? uh we have we are into clothing we are into fabrics mainly into okay. fabrics and the mm-hmm. usp is pure maheshwari silk and pure cotton okay okay and uh, i have direct connections you know uh, with the manufacturers of uh, these products mm-hmm. and uh, we try to get something in the market which is like not ready not available a little off beach collection Okay. Wherein you know, when when you wear something, somebody would uh, you would be asked from where did you get this, and that's why something aim. something kind of unique and which is not available in market. Yes, I try to do that. Yes, we are trying our best, and uh, uh, I you know personally aim not to repeat any of the collection. Okay, wonderful. So, if I talk about your vision, mission, and goal uh, for next five to ten years, how you look at that? I would like to keep it uh, slow, steady, but yes, consistent and grow slowly. I am in no rush. Okay. I am in no rush to touch the sky. I am actually not in a rush. I want to build a relationship with each of my customer. And I'm trying to do that, and to some extent, I'm also successful in that. Okay. I don't aim at anything. I wanted that feel that yes, I am doing something, 
I still am doing that. Taking care of my children, taking care mm. of my house, taking care of myself. And right. Whatever time I find, I try to work in that time, and I'm quite satisfied because right. I may not have hundreds of two hundred or thousands of customers, but yes, I have customers all over India, even outside India, and those are repeated customers. They come back to me. They ask me, you know, uh, what is the biggest success when they tell me that Monica, you tell me how it will go for me. What will it be like? You know, when a customer tells you, when a client of yours becomes a friend and they depend on you, that's your right. no success. Correct. Their Correct. trust, their trust is my earning. Correct. That is really wonderful. So, if I talk about uh, the most important life lessons you have learned. From your personal and professional life, both, what would that be? Okay, so I truly, truly, truly believe that learning would never fade, never goes waste. Whatever right. we learn in life is will be of use somewhere. Like right. I did my fashion designing. I spent for two years studying there, learned a lot. Then there was a change of career totally. But after those 16 to 18 years, again, my learning then is now useful to me because what Correct. I learned then is now helping me uh, design for people to know, the, uh, you know, uh, what body type they have, what skin type they have, how and what color would suit them, what uh, uh, what kind of prints would suit them, what work would suit them, and mm -hmm. secondly, uh, which. Type of work is in from which state? How is it happening? What fabric is from which state? So this is all right. we learn. And right. then before starting the work, I did study and I do study each day something. Correct, correct. So you have to be like uh, you have to be active uh, learner throughout if you are into like any kind of field. Very true, very true. And my journey, which in between journey, which was there, the aviation journey, a complete mm -hmm. dealing that customer service thing is now helping me out in this field here. Right, definitely, that really so helps. Each learning, I, I would say, that every time when I have learned something, I learn from my kids. My younger one teach me, you know, Mama, isko aise karlo, ab aise karo ki toh aise ho jayega. <laughs> now I think kids are more tech savvy after this COVID thing. Then as my eight-year-old teaches me something. Right. That is After really wonderful. Ah, the, that is what you know. So learning, it, it's never ending, and whatever you learn, it somehow you benefited somewhere. Correct. Correct. So um, now, if I ask you, like uh, since you you uh, mentioned that you help uh, other women to uh, like start their entrepreneurial journey, so I want to ask uh, about that only. So how a woman? Who is unprivileged or having low uh, on resources? How she can start and uh, like uh, her entrepreneurial journey, and the challenges would be there. Like how she can manage all of them. Okay, so yes, a very good, very points. I would also like to you know uh, tell you that I am associated with Nina's Club. We are uh, you know this this is uh, all all India privileged club. We have many clubs all over India. Right. In Delhi only, I think we have around seven to eight clubs. Initially, it was a, a part of Lions Club, and then the women separated and formed their own unit. And uh, uh, the, such such beautiful women uh, who have been working for years. I have recently right. joined four years back, but uh, there are women who are attached to this for about 20, 30, 25, 30 years as well. And they are so devoted towards this. We work for the social causes. Uh, we uh, are dealing, you know, we uh, deal closely or are connected rather, I would say, closely with a lot of NGOs, wherein uh, we are connected with, uh, you know, we arrange uh, uh, health camps for women. Like recently, we arranged a cancer detection camp for women. Right. We arranged an anemia camp for women. Then uh, there is another uh, NGO wherein we have uh, helped them make or you know develop a beauty parlor and a stitching center. Okay. So now what I have in my mind is we are paying for the trainers there. We are paying the salary of a trainer where all right. the underprivileged girls like who do not have a backing, who uh, do not have their closed ones with them, mm -hmm. can work there, can learn. 
and then be independent in their life correct correct so we combinedly we collect money we uh, you know some donations that we give whatever matlab aisa koi restriction nahi hota ki aapko itna karna hai jitna jiske liye hota hai kyunki hum mandir mein bhi dekhte hain hum kaha bahut log kahin pe bhi dete hain so i believe agar aap aise kaam mein bhi doge to logo ka acha hoga to it's a it's it's a you know we should give back to the society we are getting so much from the society agar hum thoda sa bhi karenge na to I think I'm blessed if I do this. No, definitely, so, everyone uh, should contribute on this aspect that somebody can get skill sets or the uh, kind of environment so that they can start their entrepreneurial journey. Maybe small, but if they start, yes. they will definitely give an employment to one or two people. That again would very be true. a one very good true. thing. Very true. Very true. Right. And, uh, The the girls out there. Uh, now I'm actually thinking about it, and I'm working towards it that I'm going to connect uh, uh, with these girls in our stitching center of the, that NGO and mm-hmm. give them work. Ask them to create pieces for me. Tell them the designing. Give them the samples. Ki aisa kar ke line so that they get work to Correct. give them employment. Correct. This Correct. is what I'm working on right now, mm-hmm. and uh, let's see how uh, things work out and. Uh, Yes, it's a small contribution, very very small little contribution. तो तो बहुत कुछ कर रहे हैं मैं सिर्फ कोशिश कर रही हूँ. Right, right, right. It's and the, the I feel good when we do something like this. Right, and the kind of programs run by uh, these NGOs to educate and help uh, like these women to start their own uh, small venture is is really a helpful thing. Uh, I have also seen uh, some of them. Uh, some of the these kind of NGOs who are working closely uh, to uplift these kind of women, their work, uh, like uh, their, their entrepreneurial journey, and uh, if uh, women uh, like who don't have uh, kind of uh, resources, they can go there, they can get the training done, and they can start their journey with a very small amount of money. and sometimes yes. if they don't have that money then also these kind of uh, there are ngos and government support with which they can start their journey as well like we had uh, in the same ngo we had you know they had a center where they were making masks in covid time right 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 so uh, so we were promoting you know that these somewhere uh, the sale of these masks Yes. मतलब कुछ ऐसा जिससे उनकी क्रिएटिविटी भी आए एंड उनकी इनकम भी हो बॉटल कुछ हम कर सके जिससे किसी के लिए भी अच्छा हो तो हम लोग को खुद को भी अच्छा लगेगा डेफिनेटली So if I if I talk about uh, like uh, how to get resources and sell their product in the market is again a big time challenge for these kind of people or women uh, who don't have much of an experience or an uh, sales exposure like how uh, this can be uh, like worked upon See initially to small skills se shuru karna padta hai uh, unless and until uh, you know uh, you like I was uh, blessed i was lucky enough that i did not have this issue and i could uh, start off my journey but right. uh, of course you know i feel ki uh, ab ab aap dekhiye jaise ki they started off with the masks in this in the center right. mm-hmm. like if i i give them work some small time work mm-hmm. and i also uh, because i can also give them work according to uh, my level what okay. i need i am not a very big name i am just try, i am just a small location in this big pond and uh, so i can just yes request and i'm trying to connect with more people who can give them work and they can have their earning 
So to once they Correct. start earning, then yes, of course, we are all there to guide them through that you can do this, you can go from here, you can earn this, you can create this, and this is how you can grow. And that's kind of the limit for anybody who who has that uh, you know just in himself. Yes, I have to do it. That will, that strong mind needs to be there. Ah. And uh, that's yes, yeah, you can do anything if you want to. Mm-hmm. You just have to be strong will. And believe me, uh, these girls are. They are. They are very strong. They are much. They are stronger than we can think of. Right, right, right. And I guess there are some NGOs also who buy back uh, also. Like they they provide yes, with the raw material, they buy back the finished goods, and pay them for the work they do. Yes, there are lot of lot of, and then you know these craft mailers and all. Ah. They are also even our government is also doing so much. Right, right, right. They can promote their product there also. Yes, there is there is a lot. It's just that we need to connect with the right people and give them the right guidance. Correct. हमें भी तो किसी ने guide किया तो हम आगे बढ़े तो अगर हम किसी को guidance देंगे और किस कोई आगे बढ़ेगा तो I think nothing like that. Definitely, and the most important thing is uh, like try to explore things, uh, whatever uh, ways you can, and very true. Talk to people like whosoever you can find. Definitely, some of them. would not be having any kind of a knowledge or experience to share or help but definitely somebody would be there in their close group or maybe family friends colleagues uh, local locality somebody would be there to uh, like who can help them out in uh, those terms as well exploring is really important these days there are a lot of women in community also where in uh, They they give, give free promotional offers uh, for the products uh, from NGOs, right. from for the those working, uh, you know, in an NGO. They get they do get that uh, stuff as well. So people are doing a lot, and I'm just trying to be a part of it. Hopefully, we can do something. And what to say? Zada ni kada chahiye, but thoda thoda sa effort hai. And I think. Hey, uh, <laughs> ठीक है हाँ. Like if, if you're talking about you supporting or somebody supporting is one aspect of it. If uh, they don't get that kind of a support, some there would be people who are not getting that kind of support. They also sh- should explore uh, like within their close pro- proximity, maybe within the same village or within the same family, friends, colleagues, whosoever they have in touch. Like somebody would be there to help them out, but they need to I try. Am, yes. So I believe we can never hope नहीं छोड़नी चाहिए। हाँ, this is what I try to like put up. And it is actually not just uh, you know uh, the uh, girls who are not so privileged or women mm-hmm. who are not so privileged. It is with anybody. I have seen so many friends getting into depression now because they had to leave, they had to quit. I have seen so many yes. women saying that we were into depression because we had left our job. For our family, for our kids, and right. now we don't know what to do. I just know. I think whatever we did, we did left because we wanted to prioritize, give quality time to our family. Right. And then it is this family which supports. And there is there is no end. I had I had I did designing, went into aviation, 16 long years. I had a movement career, and on the top of the career, I. Said where you know the, I called it off and I was like a mom that that but then yes here I am again and this and is I'm kind of happy. challenge uh, like almost all women face and yes. they had to start their journey again after the uh, like like taking care of child when they are very young they had to drop their career they had to like uh, take a break from their career maybe. Start again uh, after the things are well settled. They they start their yeah. career once again. These kind of challenges every woman face, and this is the time when they can think of like exploring and uh, experimenting with their life to start something new of their yeah, own. Maybe whatever also, interest they have. I would also like to add that we should enjoy that break period. That that transition break meaning I am telling you, so because break to mom, I never get to see my mom. I would say that transition period 
वी शुड एंजॉय दैट एज वेल एंड नॉट गेट डिप्रेस कि अरे हम तो अभी कुछ हुआ नहीं या क्या है नहीं वी शुड एंजॉय दैट एज वेल बट एट द सेम टाइम नॉट लूज होप एंड यस ऑफ कोर्स देयर इज देयर इज नो एंड इफ वी वांट वी विल गेट द थिंग्स राइट राइट वर्क हार्ड हार्ड वी शुड नेवर शाय अवे फ्रॉम वर्किंग हार्ड राइट कुछ भी छोटा नहीं है जो छोटा आज वो है आपका काम वो धीरे-धीरे आप एज वी वर्क टुवर्ड्स इट वी आर गोइंग टू राइज एंड आई एम वेरी होपफुल आपको थोड़े टाइम पे बैलेंस दिखेगा अरिबा क्रिएशन बट यस इट्स अ स्लो प्रोसेस आई एम नो आई एम नो रश आई एम इन नो रश एट ऑल आई जस्ट वांट टू गो स्लोली टेक केयर ऑफ माय फैमिली टेक केयर ऑफ माय वर्क एंड गिव माय कस्टमर्स द बेस्ट uh one thing i do not compromise is on quality no right that right compromise on quality correct correct so uh, best wishes to you for that and uh, now moving back to you again uh i can see uh, on like uh, how, what kind of uh, like uh, personality you have but still i am asking are you an introvert or an extrovert while facing your audience and what are the pluses or minuses or maybe like what are the challenges of uh, like uh, having that kind of a personality okay so i'm not an introvert i am act okay. <laughs> you can make that out yes yeah. uh, but uh, i do, okay so i like to talk i like hmm. to uh, i like to smile i like to laugh i like to share happiness but right. yes at the same time i do not like if somebody takes me for granted okay. i'm a torian And Torian is a bowl, so never mess with the Torians. They are very nice. They are very nice friends. They are the best people as you as uh, friends you can find. But yes, honesty is what the thing I expect in any relationship. Right. And I'm very honest in all my relationships, and I really expect honesty from my friends, from my family, from people around me. Really. And, uh, <clears throat> my act and again you know what my work profile my job profile has helped me uh, not to be camera shy right your profession was that only like you who are interacting with so many people and like kind of job role you had wonderful so that's what i said you know again coming back to saying your learning do not go away it's everything yes, that you yes. learn that is useful somewhere uh, definitely so, definitely you would get benefit out of it everywhere very so, true uh, very true so if i talk about uh, like your journey who all were your biggest supports my mom my husband my children my husband they are the strongest pillars i have of course my parents in law my kids whole family has been supporting my sister everybody right. whole family friends i have my friends who are very very close to me mm-hmm. and they have always supported me i'm still in touch with my school friends uh, you know who are with me since third standard okay so i have my friends who have really supported me guided <coughs> me and said ki nahi rukna nahi hai tere ko kaam karna hai tu karegi you will be successful you have to do it right right and my mother has been a biggest support uh, you know support since the beginning and i'm blessed with a wonderful husband right is there with me, fights all out for me and uh, this uh, ariba creations cannot uh, be in existence could not be in existence without for him being around and is correct correct so and that requires huge support from everyone really depending for his support you know on him for everything so <laughs> definitely and this kind of support is not only uh, required by women but men too whatever they do they require family support as well yes your partner right. support is very very important in whatever you right, doing right. your family and i think that is what you ma- that is what matters to you you have a strong family base you have good friends uh, you know around you your well wishers yes. and then there's no looking back right 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 so uh, like uh, now moving on to the next one who uh, are the people you seek for an inspiration or an motivation i'm sorry like who are the people or who what are the things you look at for inspiration and motivation in your life uh, for the people of course um, there are lot many women many people but i look at my mother she is the biggest inspiration for me right 
I think I've learned to be strong from her. Mm-hmm. I've really learned to be strong. I've learned from, uh, my husband is an inspiration. I've learned to be patient. Okay. From, you know how. So these two people play a very, very, very important role in my life. Right. Of course, I I look at other women how they are performing. Mm-hmm. I mean, you know, I'm one person. I really learn a lot from everybody. Right. I really I like to pick up good points from everyone and change myself. Ah, uh, मतलब हम लोग को जो छोटे थे ना, we've always learned from my mother. That is what she's taught me. That कभी भी ना jealous नहीं होना है. Learn करो अगर आपसे आगे कोई है, ये learn करो कि वो क्यों है, कैसे है. Correct. Correct. Changes is now. किसी के success से तुम्हें problem नहीं होना चाहिए. अपने failure से problem आना चाहिए. तो तुम लर्न करो कि क्या hmm. करना है जो तुम चेंज करोगे अपने अंदर देन दैट इज हाउ यू गोइंग टू सक्सीड करेक्ट सो आई डेफिनेटली लर्न फ्रॉम एवरीबॉडी आई रियली लर्न फ्रॉम एवरीबॉडी दिस इज रियली इंपॉर्टेंट इन लाइक योर लाइफ यू हैव सो मेनी पीपल होम यू कैन लाइक गेट इंस्पिरेशन मोटिवेशन एंड एंड दैट पर्सन कुड बी एनीवन लाइक इवन यू डोंट थिंक दैट दिस पर्सन कैन टीच यू maybe uh, the uh, the security guard of your building yes. or maybe yes. anybody like they can teach you anything like if you see them observe them you can learn any and from anyone this is really Bilkul, important Bilkul. so Bilkul. Uh, now i For want me. to understand about your take on success what do you feel or uh, what do you think uh, success look likes to you what to say so each day you know is a successful day and when it ends nicely for me i take it uh, in a very positive manner for me being honest is the is the form of a form most important thing right so whatever position that i grow into i would like to be honest we should be honest to right. ourselves for loved ones to our people who trust us to universe because right. this is what we are going to give back whatever we are doing we are going to get back mm. and for me like if i am successful and i and i would say i will be successful then when i am able to make someone else also successful correct correct that would be my success definitely if you help other people to grow to be successful yeah. then you are a, a successful in real terms Yes, that they will be success for me. Like my success will help someone else be successful. Wonderful. And, uh, this is what I think. Uh, and let's hope I am on the same track. Uh, future may mind be to agree so much. No, no, definitely. Wish. This is this is really a nice thought. Right track, always. Yeah, I'm yeah. Sorry. This is really a this is really a nice thought. And I think everyone should believe in this that they should help other people to grow and be successful. बिल्कुल क्योंकि एक दूसरे के सपोर्ट से ही हम आगे बढ़ सकते हैं यस 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 सो नाउ वी आर ऑन द उंडिटिविटीन this thing spread across the universe and it does affect our life whatever yes. we think happens with us we say um, um, you know and this is what i've learned again from my hobby is like ki kabhi negative mat bol kuch bhi nahi hoga acha hoga and that's what my mother says so again two pillars mm-hmm. strong pillars of my life and they always say ki acha hoga and even my parents in law you know i'm blessed to have them with me mm-hmm. everybody around me has taught me like that correct correct the, अच्छा होगा और हार्ड वर्क करना है देर इज डोंट टाई अवे फ्रॉम वर्किंग हार्ड कुछ भी छोटा नहीं है कुछ भी बड़ा नहीं है एंड एट द बिगिनिंग यू ऑलवेज स्टार्ट फ्रॉम अ स्क्रैच राइट यू ऑलवेज सो 
it's like ki aisa kuch nahi hai so just just be yourself just have, believe yourself and yes then there is no looking back don't lose hope correct and uh, that's about it and uh, yes and keep up with our creations keep shopping from us help us grow <laughs> definitely and uh, really uh, it was really wonderful talking to you i must say uh, it it was uh, like amazing uh, insights you have shared about so many things and uh, i was looking for hearing more from your side i really enjoyed our conversation looking forward to hear uh, from you again soon maybe on different topic uh, maybe on uh, like uh, uh, different uh, subject altogether could be on uh, your aviation industry maybe Uh, how oh, to? I would love to. There, that's an endless <laughs> thing. I can talk like, for hours. Like how people can uh, people can uh, think of their career in that industry. That that also we can talk about. Uh, Innovation is my first love. <laughs> right, definitely. So uh, looking forward to it, and uh, I must say it was really wonderful talking to you. Thank you so much for your time, and also Thank I you. would, and also I would share your uh, link of uh, social media and website. so that people can be in touch with you take your help guidance and also see your products buy them and uh, guys uh, don't forget to check that out too thank you so much everyone for watching and listening i hope you all must have gathered a lot of information and enjoyed watching it don't forget to like share and subscribe have a good time thank you and bye bye thank you so much pleasure was all mine thank you Thank you take care